What's going on, gang? Chris Cards here. Through the mail, Monday, first of three returns today comes from North Texas, Texas. Yes, just three returns today. Should be a quick through the mail Monday. Hope everyone had a great weekend. And our first return is going to be Charlie Hudson. All right. Charlie Hudson on one card. Charles Hudson on the other. Both Tiffany cards, 84 and 87. Signed very nicely there in blue. Sharpie, seven years in the bigs. Four with the fills. He was later traded from the Phils to the Yankees for the hitman, Mike Eastler, and his career kind of went downhill after that. Started two games in a 1983 World Series, lost both of them. Career ended in 1989 when, while intoxicated, ran into a pole, broke his leg, and that was it for Mr. Charles Hudson. Nice return there from Mr. Hudson. Let's move on to return number two. This one hails from Augusta, Georgia. You golf fans could appreciate Augusta, I'm sure. And we've got Denny Lemaster. Two index cards signed from him. And here are a couple of cards. Took a little while to get Mr. Lemaster back, but there you go. Denver, a.k.a. Denny. Both pretty cool baseball names, if you ask me. Signed all four of these very nicely there in ballpoint pen. Nice career for him, 11 years. Uh, started with the Braves of Milwaukee, ended with the Braves of Atlanta before moving on to a few other teams in his career. Started off as a starter. Towards the end of the career was a uh, bullpen specialist, if you will. Nice little career from him. All signed very nicely there. Super excited to get Mr. LeMaster back. Look at those. Looks good. All right, guys. Move on to our final return of the day. Final return comes from Phoenix, Arizona. Let's see who we have here. We've got a blank index card, and we've got Floyd Bannister. All right, Floyd Bannister. First overall pick by the Houston Astros in 1976. Only spent a few years with the Astros, went on to the White Sox and a few other teams. 15-year career, very good pitcher. Father of Brian Bannister, who also pitched in the big leagues, pitched for the Mets for a little while. AL strikeout leader in 1982, also was an all-star. He went 15-0 at Kennedy High School to take his team to the championship in 1973. 15-0 with a 0.00 ERA, that is incredible. No wonder why he was drafted first overall. Went to Arizona State University, though, for a brief period of time. The Sun Devils. There's his information. Don't forget to put a D. I really hope I went back and fixed that, but that was clearly not how you spell his name. I think I did. Let's just say I did. Paradise Valley, Arizona now works with his son at a professional photography studio. So go figure. That's kind of random. There you guys go. Only three returns today. I hope everyone had a great weekend. It was hot here in the Pacific Northwest. Super hot. Record hot temperatures. Unbelievably hot record temperatures. So that was not fun, but kept cool. Try to keep cool anyway. So hope everyone has a great week out there. Hopefully have more returns for you guys next week. And that's all I've got to say for today. Have a great day, and uh, that's it. All right, guys. See ya.